Hello everyone, now we will introduce WLAN and firstly let's see the definition of it. WLAN is stands for Wireless Local Area Network. It uses radio frequency technology to replace weird LAN. So WLAN can use simple access architecture to let users send and receive information anywhere. The reason why we see anywhere here is that Firstly, WLAN can be found in multiple scanner rails. For example, we can access an online meeting through WLAN. We, like, we can play online games via WLAN. And except that, in some smart city solutions, WLAN plays a very important role. So does uh, Health Care and warehouse industries. Except the measured applications based on WLAN, the terminals we're using nowadays has become supp defaultly support WLAN. For example, the projector, the mobile, the pad, the laptop, and even the printers and the cameras. The reason why WLAN has become so widely used, let's think about it. And from my point of view, the first possible advantage is the convenience. We can access the WLAN network conveniently, no matter in office, no matter in the airport, in the classroom, in the hotel, and even in the park, in the shopping malls, and so on. Except the convenient access, wireless also makes network more economical. Let's see a typical scanner reel. From the picture, we can see this is a kitchen. In this kitchen, we have coffee machines, we have fridges, we have lights, and some other different types of devices. All these devices can be controlled by an app in the mobile. And this is a smart home solution. And in this scan wheel, without WLAN, we should connect each device via cables. The cost of these cables would be high, right? and uh, maybe the implementation of these devices could be very complex. This is a smart home scan reel, but for some terminals, expressways, harbors, this kind of scan reels, that the devices or the terminals are very far from each other. So the cables we need would be very long. So from this kind of situation, we can find that the wearing between the terminal and the access device is omitted, which effectively reducing the wearing cost. Here are two advantages of WLAN. And with the development of the applications we just mentioned, and at the same time with the development of the terminals, WLAN technology has become a very important and popular network technology and the increasing demand the mobile computing technology is more favored all these reasons contribute to the widely used WLAN nowadays and truly re realize the 6a 6a means that anyone can access the network at any time and anywhere by any means no matter you are using a mobile, you are using your laptop, you are using your pad, and some other means. After accessing to the WLAN, we can communicate with any other about anything. This is a 6A. So, after the WLAN introduction, I hope you can know what is WLAN, the typical applications of WLAN, and the advantages of WLAN. So that's all for this part. Thank you.